Hi everyone, my name is Christy and welcome to my trying a new makeup product everyday series. Today I'm so excited to try out my first ever Dragon Beauty product from Nikita Dragon's makeup line. This is the Dragon Glass Matte Liquid Lip that I got in the shade Bad, B-I-T-C-H, <laughs> I don't swear on my channel so I had to spell it out. But this looks like a beautiful shade and I am so excited about this because I love trying out liquid lipsticks, lip products, and I have very dry lips and this claims to be a moisturizing matte liquid lipstick because of the nourishing ingredients in it. So I'm extra excited to see how this formula is going to be. I love the packaging. It looks like a crystal. It's so beautiful and unique. This retails for $18, and I saw a few other shades that this comes in as well. So let's go ahead and check out the applicator on this. Ooh, I like this, the pointy applicator. Oh, and I noticed that vanilla smell right away. Such a nice, sweet vanilla scent. And by the way, if you have not seen my unbagging yet of my September 2021 Ipsy Glam Bag Plus, I'll have that video linked in the description down below. I am so happy with that bag and all of the makeup I got this month. But so before I apply this to my lips, let's go ahead and do a swatch. Pretty. This actually looks very similar to my natural lip color, which I love to try and find a perfect nude for me type of lip that matches closely to my natural lip tone. And this is like very similar. Well, let's go ahead and see how it looks on me. It's also very pigmented, which I love to see. Look at the difference. Top lip with it, without it, bottom lip with it. So similar, right? I would say that this lip color is maybe just one tiny little shade lighter than my natural lip color. And wow, it is so pigmented that you really just need that one swipe. And the applicator holds a lot of product on it. I really like it. You can see it's also kind of at an angle, but For the fun of it, I'm just layering it up to see what color I can get it to, but it is staying pretty much the exact same shade as I layer it up. But this is really beautiful. So quick and easy to apply, but it's been a little while and it's not drying down on my lips yet. Let's see if it dried down in the swatch. No, it, I mean, it's smudged. It stays like a creamy, formula. That's surprising. It's not what I was expecting, but yeah, it doesn't even look matte. It has a cream finish to it, but I really like this shade. It's flattering. It's neutral to go with any look, any time of day, any season. So I love that. And it is so comfortable. It feels moisturizing. I will say it doesn't look super moisturizing though, as far as like smoothing out the lines in my lips. For some reason, it seems to be accentuating the lines in my lips, even though it's not like clinging to dry patches and it's not dry, it's not smoothing to the lips really. And now I'm very curious to see the transfer. Oh my gosh, that is so much transfer for a matte liquid lip. Matte liquid lipsticks are the products that are supposed to have no transfer. Not supposed to have, but tend to have no transfer and that's what I love about them. But that's a lot of transfer, like the most transfer in a lip product right here. And the color faded from all that transfer too. Like it still looks good, but I wish this actually dried down and didn't have the transfer to it because this is just not what I look for in a lip product. It's pretty, but 
I really want something that I'm not gonna have to worry about all day long. And this is such a perfect color to wear all day long and it's so comfortable, but just my personal preference that is like too much transfer, too much of a hassle for me when there are amazing transfer proof, long lasting liquid lipsticks out there. And considering how expensive this is, it's nice, but it's just definitely not my favorite. And I am very curious to hear your thoughts on this lipstick in the comments down below if you've tried it out. But wow, I'm very surprised by this. It's not what I was expecting based off the name, the description, but now I know. I love when Ipsy gets new and exciting brands in their glam bags. Well, thank you so much for watching my video today. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel so you can see the makeup that I try every day. And I will see you tomorrow in my next video.